drivers of New York City's horse-drawn carriages and pedicabs gathered separately on Tuesday to rally against proposed changes to the way they operate here. Save our jobs! De Blasio, save our jobs! Mayor Bill de Blasio pledged to ban the carriages entirely in his election campaign. Now he has struck a deal with the carriage drivers' union that lets them stay, but cuts their numbers and takes them off city streets, confining them to Central Park. Carriage drivers would have less competition than they do now from pedicab operators, who also offer tours through the park. Under the deal, pedicabs would be banned from the park's southern half, but operators say that's where most of their business is. About 50 people met near City Hall to protest that part of the deal. Anybody who knows the park knows that the lower loop is the tour. We give a one-hour tour, half-hour tour, depending on what the people want. Uh, this would affect me directly because that's how I make my living. If I am not able to get tourists, how am I wanna be, gonna be eating? How am I gonna pay my rent? How am I gonna be paying my school fee? On Tuesday, Mayor de Blasio said the city had to make an adjustment for pedicabs for balance. Carriage drivers who met at stables in Midtown said the mayor's announcement of the deal was premature. They pledged to fight a proposed reduction of the number of horses in the fleet from around 180 to 95. What the mayor's plan is asking us to do to reduce the number of horse licenses is fundamentally bad for the horses, and we will not stand by that. It ultimately makes it more difficult for owners to give their horses vacations. It makes it more difficult to give owners, for owners to give their horses days off. As part of the de Blasio deal, the horses would be moved to a refurbished stable in Central Park, which the city would spend $20 million or more to renovate. Drivers reacted to that aspect with caution. We absolutely love the idea of moving into Central Park. We absolutely love it. Um, we also do not and will not agree to move out of our beautiful stables until, until the stable is opened in Central Park. The agreement must still be approved by the City Council. If it is, changes would go into effect this spring.